Good morning, folks. How you doing? You all right? Did you sleep well last night? Hey, listen, I got some great news for you. Margaret's home. Yeah, she came home yesterday about well, three o'clock or something. They let her out. Um, and she's, she's looking good. She's coming right. Uh, she's had a bit of a rough time. My gee, she did. They couldn't stop her eyes ble bleeding. But she's right now, so I'm pretty excited. And the other thing I'm pretty excited about is this. See this? This is a video. It's called Trevor Griffiths Rose Garden, Timaru, New Zealand. Right? And the commentary is by former Mayor Wynne Raymond. Him and I did this video together, you see. And, and on the back of it, it's got all the uh, contents, what's in it. And, and, I've, and I've thrown a, a couple of other things in too. Um, where is it? Over here. Show you. Oops. Yeah, it's in two parts. This is part one, you see. Uh, part one, and I've signed it. Right? Because I, I, I'm, it's my video, and I signed it. Personalised, right? The part two, Trevor Griffiths Rose Garden, um, I've signed this as well, but it's also a Sunday sermon of fa about family love. So I've thrown this in for free. So I'm selling the DVD uh, on the garden, f and, I've, and I've thrown in a sermon on love. Great Christmas present. And now I was going to give one of these to uh, Nan Raymond. She was the president of the Beautifying Society at the time when they built the Rose Garden. And poor Nan, she's in a home now. Um, she, she, she's having mental health problems and she's in a home. So, um, and I wanted to give her one of these for her birthday because her birthday is on the 20th of this month. When told me on, on, the, on the video, he said she's having a birthday uh, um, uh, on the twentieth, and I was going to give her one of these, uh, the, these DVDs. You see, I don't know whether she can watch it or not, but I was going to give her one for Christmas, for for, for a birthday. Sorry, but um, something happened. I must have said the wrong thing on one of my videos or something, and it upset Win, and he rang me up and said he didn't want anything more to do with me. You see. So I've got offside with the guy that did the commentary, which is Wynne Raymond, former mayor of Timaru. It's not unusual for me to get offside with people. <laughs> it's happening all the time because I'm a bit different. I uh, think differently uh, and I wind people up a bit. If they give me a hard time, I'll wind them up. And um, so I get a bit unpopular. But it's sad, isn't it? Eh? It's sad. I rang Wynne up this morning and said, listen, the video's ready, when, if, if, you, if you want it, the video's ready. Um, he said, oh, okay, okay, thank you, and hung up, you see. No conversation at all. I gave a copy, that, there's, only one, there's only one lot of copies out there, and I, and I sold it to um, Betty Manning. I don't know whether you know Betty Manning, she's a partner of uh, Wynne, Ra um, not Wynne Raymond, what the hell's his name, Steve Newman. Steve and Betty been living together for years. And I sold one to her. But she hasn't rung me up and told me whether she got it. I had to put it in the mailbox, but she didn't ring, ring me up and thank me or anything. So, and I went around there today to try and see her, to see if she'd got the uh, video, but she didn't, um, she wasn't home. So, I'm having a bit of trouble. There's some other good news though, because I've got a video, I've got a, um, an email from Keep, New Zealand Beautiful, an organisation in Auckland somewhere, calling, calling themselves Keep New Zealand Beautiful. And there's a little book that they sent me on how to keep New Zealand beautiful. And you've got to form a, uh, a group in your town, you see, uh, to keep your town beautiful. And um, I'm having a bit of trouble. I'm, I'm trying to do it. I'm trying to keep the town beautiful. I'm going around painting up the pubs that need painting and getting into trouble. Uh, trying to get the message across that we have to keep Timaru beautiful because we've got a great town here. Uh, bugger all people come here because it's too bloody rough. Some of the buildings are pretty rough uh, and they need to be tidied up. And I've got a list there of all the buildings that need to be tidied up. I went down the street the other day and I, I wrote them all down 
uh, uh, this is only in the south end of town, without the, the north end. This is just the south end of Timaru. Just a minute. Yeah, here's the list. Keep Timaru beautiful, right? Uh, Timaru Sadler and Harness on the corner of North and Stafford Street. The Comic Shop, 42 Stafford. Flats, 48A, Stafford Street. 52 Stafford Street. Distillers Warehouse, 60 Stafford Street. Carlton Hotel, 66 Stafford Street. Gary's Bakery, Stafford Street, Lawrence Tyree's House at 9 Wilcom Street, Caroline Motors at 13 Wilcom Street, Plumbing World, uh, Wilcom Street, Trading World, 79 Stafford Street, Timaru Herald Garage Sale Sign, uh, 88 Stafford Street, Tom Timothy T Tube Works Limited, Timaru Theatre Royal, Takeaway Food Bar, Budget Taxis, 128 Stafford Street, 148A Stafford Street, Butterfield's Building, Meehan's Building, Restaurant 5, 7 George Street, National Bank Building, Bar 1 Nightclub, 113 Stafford Street, Historic Movie Theatre, Stafford Street, 101 Stafford Street, Danny's Internet Cafe, Araki Hostel, 63 Stafford Street, Motorcycle World, Keeman's Tools and Equipment, Secretarial Services, 47 Stafford Street, Vegetarian Grocery Shop, 41 Stafford Street, Punjab Indian Restaurant, South Canterbury Electric Power Board and 5 Barnard Street. So that's my list. And I've sent it off to Keep New Zealand Beautiful, an organisation called Keep New Zealand Beautiful. What they're saying to me is to get a, get a group together. I've got to get a group together. See, I've got to do all the bloody work. No one in Timaru will give me a hand. I've been trying to do it for, for ages. Just a minute, there's the phone. That was my oldest daughter, Kerry. She rang up. She's a postie. Not working today because there's bloody no mail. Fancy that, right on Christmas, there's no mail. Uh, she didn't have to work because of no mail. Christmas time. You'd think she'd be flat out, wouldn't you? But anyway, uh, we we have a bit of banter with each other. You know, I'm bantering her all the time, and she's bantering me, and and uh, because I, I'm getting in trouble with my family, doing videos about them and upsetting them, and I upset a few people, but I love them all. <laughs> I love my family. Uh, I reckon they're great. But I'm just trying to teach them that you can't just turn your back on people. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Um, yeah, well, uh, what am I going to do now? I've got so much stuff here to do. Listen, I'll, I'll get away. I'll, I'll go out and see if I can uh, sell some of these videos, some of these DVDs that I've uh, got. Uh, I need to make some money because it's Christmas time and, and and Mum just said go and get her pills and prescription and I've got to uh, get some meat for Bo. Uh, the bloody neighbour's cat keeps coming over and eating all his meat. Um, and, and we've got problems with the bloody animals as well as the people, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, listen, look after yourself. Don't forget tomorrow. I'll, I'll be on again tomorrow. I don't know whether I'll get another one done today, but I'll, I'll be on again tomorrow. And listen, keep Timaru City beautiful. If anyone wants to give me a hand, will they phone me, please? Anyone in Timaru at all, just give me a call. 03-6861-271. Call Ron Bishop, Timaru Tourist Promotions Limited. I'm looking for people to give me a hand to keep Timaru City beautiful. Okay? So if you're here, anybody, let me know. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow.